What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. So, the first thing I want to do this episode is get that death root. Uh, we've gotten good spells from that guy so far. Think, think death root will be another good spell. Um, thing is, with all of those skeletons attacking, things get a little hectic. Alright, so that one disappears. You know what? It's definitely the one I could target. I think we need to we need to find the skeleton that we can lock onto. And then we need to kill him. And I think that's how we get it. Torrent, hang in there, buddy. Yeah, because we did damage and then he disappeared. No, oh, wait. Your health is the same as it was. There are two distinct skeletons that are showing up. There's the one that pops up and just swipes. And that's not what we need. We need... What is that item? Hang on. Is that... I have a buff on. I don't know what the buff even is. So you move between two locations. Again? So it seems like there's two separate main skeletons. Oh, fuck. There's two main skeletons that'll show up. One over here and the one over there. He stopped. Is there a third one? Maybe it doesn't go until you kill both. Where is my death root, bro? That's two giant blasty type skeletons that we have killed. There you go, buddy. Hmm, 
so the two that we killed, they're not respawning. And we killed the death bird. Shit. Oh god, I didn't die. Hang on. There's something here. Is this our death root? Was this it all along just sitting right here? No, it's starlight shards, damn it. Ugh. Maybe there's like a catacomb entrance that I'm not seeing. Sucks. I feel like I've been pretty thorough here. And we had... Oh my god, you little bitch. Hiding over here by yourself, are ya? Torrent. Give me my goody. And what is that? Health and steeple. Steeple. Oh no. All I saw was badass sword. Alright. That's done. Let's go down and get him. Um. There's still those, there's the, 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 the starlight ruins and the puzzle we haven't solved, but I'll be honest, I, I don't know. I think, um, I think I'm better off just leaving those for now and, you know, I don't need to solve every mystery of Elden Ring by myself. Other people are going to start playing the game soon. Someone will probably be like, oh yeah, I was a sorcerer and I just had to cast starlight shards and then the jellyfish got all happy and... Gave me loot and disappeared. Great. Now I know. So didn't I get a lightning spell at some point that I didn't try out too? I did. I don't know if I got a lightning spell though, or if it was like an Ash of War. It's from Vike. I'll have to look. This place looks like it's pretty beefy. So we're gonna save that. I'm just gonna grab this. The castle is gonna be its own episode. Um. What else did this guy have? He had the sword and... Oh, I did. Vikes Dragon Bolt. 
bolsters right hand armament and body with red lightning. Red lightning to bolster the body and their armament. Chance armament with lightning attack affinity increases maximum equip load. However, lightning damage negation will be reduced. Alright, well, I can't even enchant my weapon, so that's out of the question. Um, I'm trying to remember. The boss had. Oh, yeah, it was a sorcery, besides the sword. Okay, so we got Castle Soul. Valley Ruins. What else is out here? I don't think I get there from here. Maybe that's the, the tree region? Because I'm looking at it and I don't see. I see mountain, 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 mountain. I don't see a pathway through at all. Which means there is another region waiting for us. It's ridiculous. Um, well, you know what? Instead, let's go over here. Um, well, no, hang on. Let me go. Let me go check the spell first. Let me go see what Beast Man has for me. Go do that. Go do Beast Man. It's right down here. What do y'all think? Are we going to break 100 episodes of Elden Ring? I think we are. My death. I shall grant thee. Feed me. Stone of Garank. Garank. Big donk. I just throw a giant fucking rock and stuff for lots of damage because that sounds fun. Um, we'll drop Beast Claw for now. Earl's a boulder. These are very low faith requirements. Long ago, Garonk was a beast of such terrifying ferocity that his former name meant death of the demigods. Hurl border. It can be cast repeatedly. Bro. Charges enhanced potency and causes them to explode. Let me see something. I didn't notice that when I was casting it. Because it causes... I mean, it might be good for a PvP thing, like, because, you know, PvP people don't stand still. So, being able to toss that out and, uh, basically, like, roll catch and boom, 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 boom. That could be useful. Um, you know what? I want to do that upper area, but hang on. I didn't... Rena's Rise, Selvis, Rani. I didn't do Rena's Rise. I think that's what he was talking about. He was like, oh yeah, you gotta go to the third tower. And I don't, I didn't go there. Let me... I wanna see. Because we still haven't like looked at all the new armor and shit in the game. And I'm curious if... Rena's Rise... Why is it called th I guess the towers are, are the sisters. I was say I have like, Celis said, or Celis ain't no sister. Yeah, I think this was closed up last time I was here. Or something up top was closed up. No, wait, Rena. Renala is the name of the boss. Who's Rena then? Snow Witch. Ah, uh, this is new. Where is it eating me? Ansel River, Maine. Oh, this part! I remember being like, I know there's more to this river. There's stuff that I haven't done. I need to figure out how to get here. Damn, dude, it's been so long. A miniature Ronnie? That sounds adorable. I want one. How long before Ronnie figurine for sale? Let's see something. Oh, it's not that. I don't know what that buff is that I have. So looking at my buffs, arsenal buff. And then we have that. And we have turtle buff and we have charge attacks. Oh, hang on. This gives me a unique buff. Oh, HP restoration upon killing an enemy. That's what it is. 
Uh, mini Ronnie. What else did we get? That as well. But the sword effect has that. I don't know if it stacks. Poisoning or rot in vicinity increases attack power. That's kind of cool sounding. Uh, where's the miniature? What's the miniature Ronnie for, dude? Mm. Is it a thing? Is it like a usable? Like summon mini Ronnie to cast spells that destroy things. Snipey archer. I feel like this one would be a better archer, but whatever. Um. Miniature. Is it key item maybe? Uh, and the edgy sword, ruinous ghost flame. I need int. That looks, dude. This every swing the sword to bathe its blade in ghost flame. The ghost flame adds magic damage and has a bitterly cold bite. Though that's like the ultimate edge lord sword for any spell sword build. In strength, I've actually seen some like pretty disgusting in strength weapons. Uh, and I've got new stuff too there. I gotta look. Right cards, West Atlas Tower, East, East Altless, West Altless, I got five keys on deck. Manager, Ronnie, a doll resembling Ronnie the Witch. From head to toe, every detail is perfect. This unresponsive doll seems pleasantly cool. Wait, is it, maybe it's actually Ronnie and she's been turned into a doll. That'd be cool. Um, and I wanted to... I haven't seen the Altus Towers, so... Divine Tower of the West. Where the hell is the Divine Tower of the East? I'm trying to find something that has that, you know, the general... I think all the Divine Towers kind of have that shape, yeah. Uh... Oh! There it is. Right there. Alright. Found it. So we got to do both of those. Um, let's go into this. I see a giant or something up ahead. Let's go this way first. My guess is that this place is just like boss fights. Like probably a boss fight here, some kind of Hydra or something. Let's see. The summon hasn't shown up yet. Oh, no, there's nothing. That's a ledge. That's a long way down. How crazy would it be if you had to dive into the water, and when you did, it, like, popped you up in an underground spring, and there was a whole other boss? Things. I'm just gonna be a troll. Words, actions. really hope a couple, at least a couple people look at that and they're like, hmm, I'll try it, <laughs> and they just die. I mean, that's, that's a pretty harmless death. There's, you know, the thing is right here. Oh, man, so we gotta go get the, we gotta go get the candle. Let me see. He said, well, hang on, let me think here. He said, well, you need to get the kindling, and then you need to use yourself instead of the maiden if you want to become the Lord of Madness, which I do. Uh. Well, la-dee-da, look who it is. I'm sure y'all remember that guy. Surprise, he's back. 
Remember when I murdered that thing while I was inside of a dungeon? The Ool Palace Ruins. What have you done to my Ronnie? It doesn't hit as far either. That sucks. I still like it. Another seven. And some lots of ghost glove work. This is a cool little area. But what is it down here? My buddy wouldn't tell me anything. He was just like, we we're talking about the wolf farmer. I was like, yeah, did you did you ever get the armor from the guy? And he's like, oh. You must not have finished the quest. I'm like, uh, what, what, what do you mean? He's like, you gotta finish the quest. Did you go to the third tower? And I'm like, no, it was locked. He's like, go to the third tower. Oh, okay. But honestly, like, that's that's the best. Like, if people are going to give you tips, that's the best way to go about it. Because if he had been like, oh, go to the third tower, and then you're going to use a teleporter, and you're going to go back down, you're going to finish the river zone, uh, you're going to have to fight past them. So I'm like, whoa, 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 all you had to say was just go back to the tower. I can I can find my way from the tower. I don't need to. I don't need to carry my hand the whole way. Oh, that was close. I almost just ran right off that edge. Die. Wait, this tree is also doing madness. That's it. All right, let's let's go. Uh, let's 
Wait, I have something else. I have some kind of buff I've never seen before. And I'm twinkling. Did I get a buff from killing that thing? Watch, there's like a water walk buff and I have actually have it right now. this. Those are just ants, but they're flying ants. I think I'd go down there, but first... Ants don't like fire. Um, one of these ways will lead to a boss. One of them is a dead end. I don't know who the fuck that is. So the old palace ruins is a whole, there's a whole ass zone down here, bro. I'm just gonna keep this episode going. I know we like, I didn't even try my new beast thing yet, did I? All right, we started with the death fruit and I got my beast thing and then, you know, I got a little sidetracked coming out here, but we're here, we're, we're doing it. It's seeing this through to the end. And then, we're gonna look at armor, we're gonna go to a castle, we're gonna go do some flame stuff. Oh, there's so much to do. So much to do. Noxtella Eternal City? What the fuck, dude? There's a whole ass another city? Dude, what? Oh my god. Bro, every time I'm like, oh, all right. I think I'm almost done Elden Ring. It's like, hey, actually, here's a whole other zone that you just forgot about. Jesus, it does not end. Hang on, oh, I'm doing this wrong. Let me get the grace and then climb back up and out of here. Well, maybe we are, maybe we are wrapping up. I don't know. We, we just discovered a whole ass city. Let me try and finish the, the, uh, Ool Palace Ruins first. At least so that that's, that's done. Because I think that might just be a couple loots over past that big crab. And then we can tackle whatever the hell. Is that a knight riding a fucking fire ant? Bro, this place is wild. There's so much to this game. Like... It's, it's really hard, because I, I need to start, like, you know, I'm thinking about my experience and what I would even rate the game. And for a minute at the start, I mean, I was, I was, I, well, I've enjoyed myself the entire time, but there's a bit where I was like, man, this, there's just too many bugs that are happening, you know. I can't in good faith say this is a 10 out of 10 with, with all the, all the fucking bugs, you know, like, the dragon that disappeared. Like I had, I had the one, I had the dragon that disappeared on me, and then I had the mausoleums that I got locked out of, and, uh, you know, we just, we kept having, like, things, like, just bugs, 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 and I'm like, man, like, you know, there's only so many, there's only so much of that that you can put up with before you're like, this is bullshit, you know, like, bug, like, there shouldn't be this many bugs in a game, you know? And I, I still think there's there's definitely some bugs, but the, uh, the more I play, where are we exactly? 
Things of Astor. Man, I don't recognize this area, but it looks like we should be able to get here from the river downstream. Holy shit! Hehe, <laughs> big rock. <laughs> big rock go smash. Yo, beast incantations are fucking hilarious. <laughs> Just a giant rock. The damage on that too. Like that's a problem, man. Y'all see how much damage that thing did? But you're telling me my mega charged fireball is just like eh. And that's rapid fire! I can throw those, I can spam throw those. A cancerous that's gonna be in PvP. I'm thinking I've been down here. I just don't remember killing that centipede thing before, which is what's throwing me off. Uh, if I drop, I can drop over there safely. Let's drop over there and we'll just run around this zone to confirm whether or not it's it's been cleared or not. Nope. Oh, wow. I survived. Ah, uh, here. Probably somebody, ah, uh, like, uh, hide from the thing. Because if I've been here, there's got to be like a chest that's been looted or something. You know, some some type of indication like, yes. You have, in fact, cleared out this zone. Well, hang on. Why was this guy even here? Because you can't get him from any other place but here. But I don't remember ever encountering him, and I know I... Cleared the Anzil River downstream. Hey, look. Uh. Oh no! Hang on. There's some. Maybe I couldn't... No, I don't think I could, because wasn't there, like, a waterfall? I want to say there was a waterfall that was preventing me from going that way. Uh, but back to what I was saying, though, like... I mean, there's, there's, there have been bugs. You know, the mausoleum bug, that one pissed me off a lot. The dragon disappearing definitely pissed me off. Uh, you know, the, the constant uh, dialogue issue we had until we rebound back to standard. That just seemed like a, an oversight, you know? Like, why would that even be a thing? Um, and at first, I was like, you know, a lot of this stuff, this is, this is, to me at least, this feels really egregious. Like, you know, this shouldn't be... Uh, you know, a AAA game should not experience bullshit like this. But the more I play this, the more I'm just like, oh, here's a whole new zone. Oh, here's a whole new zone. Oh, oh, it's another zone? What? An underground city? Like, it just, it's more and more and more and more and more and more. And the game doesn't stop. It just keeps throwing areas at you. And because of that, I think there's a... You know, I think there's a certain allowance that comes along with open world games, just by the nature of them being open world games. You know, you look at at your Skyrims and your Assassin's Creed and and uh, Fallout's and you know all all of these games that are large open worlds, and there's there's always going to be some bugs, just because with a world that size. It's impossible to make sure that everything is perfect. It's just, you know, it's, it's, there's too much. There's just too damn much. And so, the more I play, and the more I see that, the more I'm like, well, you know, there have been bugs, and those bugs have sucked, but... 
I mean, when you consider the sheer scope of this game and just, you know, how much there is to do and explore and see, it's like... Well, a couple, of the, a couple of bugs are, are gonna happen, you know? That's, that's, I'm feeling more and more like... That's it. There's just, there's gonna be a couple bugs. Okay, that's just how it is. There's no way around it. I don't even remember running through here. Boys, boys, boys. Holy shit, that was fucking cool. Yeah, the range on that ability is so fucking insane. I remember this, because I remember being like, well, there's the pilgrimage. Okay, so I remember seeing the pilgrimage, and then I came this way. So I just didn't finish doing this zone when I was here originally. Yeah, because smithing stone tier one, like, this is some, some low tier stuff we're finding. So yeah, I don't know. I, I'd still think the the performance issues, those those need to be resolved for sure. You know, no matter how much credit I'm gonna give them uh, for their world design and the sheer scope of this game. You know, I, I can live with a few bugs here and there. I know bugs can be fixed. The performance issues, those definitely need a, uh, those need a touch up. So right now, I think that's that's the most egregious thing. I think there's like the issues where we're we're playing, and then you know the shadows and the shaders those start just flickering really badly. That's that's just bad. There's no you know there's no way to sugarcoat that. Like oh well, the game's big. There's gonna be a couple shader issues here and there. You know like that doesn't make sense. Uh, can y'all like fuck off? I don't want to bother any more time with y'all. I've I've cleared this. We're done. I mean, y'all can all gather up if you want. You know, it makes sense. I've been here, but I think... Yeah, because I remember running all the way past them and finding the merchant. And then being like, huh, you have nothing I need. I yeah, will grab that stuff now. Alright. So, we're gonna wrap, um... Another Eternal City. Noxtella. Wait, Dragonkin's... Oh, so I killed... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Well, we got Noxtella the Eternal City up next. So, stay tuned and I'll catch y'all soon with that.